What's up guys, Houndish here, and today we're jumping in with a pretty exciting Destiny 2 Beyond Light video. And in this one we do get a brand new trailer, specifically for Europa, the new destination in the Fall expansion. And so that means loads of cool shots of Europa itself, but also a little bit more gameplay footage. We see some bits that are obviously going to be tied very strongly to the story, the return to the interior of pyramid ships, but also we get confirmation that Varix will indeed be a key character inside of Beyond Light. And then of course we see a bunch of new weapons, gear, very interesting looking locations, as well as enemies, and a bunch of other stuff. Actually, a very, very good trailer right here. So we're going to break it down in the video. And guys, as always, I hope you do enjoy this one. And now let's get into it. As always, when we get a new trailer drop, it's worth running the full thing. So here it is. What have you seen out there? Look beyond the frozen wasteland. Europa is a place of many mysteries. Do not lose your way. We all come to this moon looking for answers. What do you hope to find here? Europa has been home to darkness for some time now. Its history could be the key to our fight. Help me unlock it. Deepest secrets of Europa are now within our grasp. Now, immediately inside of the trailer, we'll hear the voice of Varix. I'm guessing Varix is still going to be an ally of ours, although. It doesn't seem entirely certain. He definitely has a pretty sinister voice here for Destiny 2. And he talks about the dangers of Europa and the secrets hidden within. And very striking inside a lot of the gameplay here, we see some pretty fantastic structures. And they do share the same visual theme with both the interiors of pyramid ships like we saw in Shadowkeep, but also some of the graphics and things we've seen with Season of Arrivals, pyramid scales and things like that. Safe to say the geometry and the location in general looks very, very cool. In some of these spaces, we also appear to have a pretty strong Vex presence. And then moving through the gameplay, we see what presumably are new areas inside of Clovis Bray and the Deepstone Crypt here but also some really cavernous spaces which look neat. And again, those kind of curious structures, but then we start to see more guardians with new gear. So in this clip, we see a weapon that we know comes from the Europa set of weapons. That's on the left-hand side. In the middle, the hunter has kind of a weapon with a gold skin on it, but that appears to share the same kind of general model as the one that the warlock has on the right-hand side. Some of these spaces here are really, really cool. And we can see Bray Exoscience and a new icon specifically for Bray Exoscience right there. And both structurally and visually in general, these are some kind of really new palettes for the game. We see here what appears to be an action sequence that includes AI in the form of one of these assault bots here. So possibly looking at a mission sequence right here or a specific encounter. But again, really cool shots, especially inside of the Bray facilities. We can see what appear to be exos hooked up in machinery alongside Vex. And then a bunch of spaces which look more kind of puzzly. We've got a bunch of new visual effects for when the Fallen are actually using Stasis abilities here. Pretty creepy stuff. As well as that general new Fallen skin and the slightly updated theme for the House of Darkness. And those are the Fallen specifically kind of seeking the technology inside of the Pyramid ships. Again, we see that Vex connection here with a bunch of Vex, including some that have tentacles very similar to Gorgons from the Vault of Glass. And these are all over these kind of pyramid style structures, even with Vex portals there. And so I think we are still going to see a link between the Vex and what's going on with that pyramid story. It's possible that we're even getting a tease for the raid or something in this very final clip here with a huge portal beneath some Vex architecture. So certainly a pretty cool trailer. Once again, we get to see a bunch of juicy stuff we haven't really spotted before. And as always, give us your thoughts down below. But for now, kind of a short and sweet video. Quick look at that new trailer. Awesome to see confirmation that Varix is going to return. And it obviously does expand on the scope of the story for this DLC drop. So certainly very exciting stuff. And I'd certainly love to get some thoughts from you guys down below. But if you have enjoyed the video, a rating really helps me out here on the channel. But also feel free to get subscribed so I can keep you posted with all the new Destiny 2 content. However, otherwise for now, guys, I hope you have an awesome day.